Hey folks, Todd Tremonti here with another video on why it is a great idea to live in Garland, or even if you don't live in Garland, to visit Garland. So um, if you live in the area and you've never really visited Garland, it's been a pass through for you on the way to something else, you gotta check out Firewheel. Firewheel is one of the many reasons that living in Garland is a good idea. Firewheel is kind of that northern edge of Garland, um, north of 190 or George Bush, uh, real close to kind of Saxe and on your way out to Wiley. Uh, Firewheel Town Center specifically is this amazing outdoor mall, outdoor shopping area that's huge, movie theaters, um, uh, big box um, stores, as well as some boutique stuff, a lot of great food out there, some entertainment options. Uh, we've been out there and taken the kids to do the little mini train rides. Um, there's some really, really good restaurants out there. They do some cool entertainment stuff around the holidays. They have great fireworks at 4th of July, some really cool Christmas stuff. They do a couple parades and things throughout the year. When the weather's nice, they'll do the um, just kind of weekend fun, like bungee jump and spin kind of things out in front of the movie theater. And there's still a, quite a bit of an available land in the Firewheel Town Center area. So I expect there to be consistent development uh, you know, in the future. They just put a new at home out there. There's, um, you know, Lowe's, Home Depot, that kind of stuff. Best Buy, things like that. But um, it's not just the Firewheel Town Center. That's a really cool kind of retail restaurant development. But the neighborhoods in and around Firewheel and, of course, Firewheel Golf, uh, I think they call it Golf Park because there's more than one course. Um, there's actually multiple full 18-hole courses. I think there's 54 holes out there. Um, make the Firewheel area just a really cool area. Um, it's obviously been there for a long time, but many of the homes are 90s built or newer. Um, there's still some construction or reconstruction happening in the area, but mostly developed kind of 90s to early 2000s. Um, just a really well-maintained, good-looking area with a lot to offer as far as restaurant, retail, entertainment, um, you know, sports and outdoors. Uh, bumps right up against the Breckenridge area of Richardson. So between Firewheel and Breckenridge, you get all sorts of hike and bike trails and parks and entertainment and things like that. Uh, again, with room to continue to grow and expand. So um, Firewheel is a great reason to live in Garland as well as a great reason to visit. But if you're thinking about a move to the area and Firewheel is attractive to you, uh, again, a variety of housing options. You do have some really cool apartment living options right there connected to that Firewheel Town Center, as well as some uh, mid-size uh, single family opportunities and some pretty large luxury property in the neighborhoods that fit within that Firewheel uh, area of Garland. Again, the northern side of Garland, right around George Bush or 190, the toll road there, and um, North Garland Road, uh, Highway 78 over to you know Firewheel Parkway is kind of the the boundary on that other end as uh, George Bush starts to kind of bend south and head towards the lake and Highway 30 there. So really cool area in Garland. One of many really really great reasons to consider living in or moving to Garland. So check that out. Check out the other videos in this series or even check out our relocation series. And uh, if we could ever help you make a move to the area or within the area. Obviously, we'd love to earn your trust, earn your business, and do that. So you can find some information about us below. Click a link, call a phone number. We'd love to help you check out Firewheel or any other area. I will talk to you on the next one. Take care.